In this very quick demonstration, we're going to show an example of the combined packing, slip, and shipping label document that you can use to speed up the shipping process and reduce the amount of paperwork and labeling you have to do as you do it. So we'll start here and grab a sales order in the ERP system. As you know, everything we do with PageJet is integrated with the ERP systems. So we're going to make a copy of this sales order. In this example, I picked a single item sales order. That's a great use case for this, this particular document form or label form. Uh, we'll fulfill it because you just want to get a single box item. Maybe it's an e-commerce order out the door quickly. So we mark the inventory that we're using, standard picking process in the ERP system, which activates the shipping tools and we could use various use cases. This one we're just going to do a uh, one by one shipping process just to uh, uh, create this document very quickly. So here it has auto packed the shipment looking at the items and said well this is a small box so we can see here it's just my desktop speakers in a box it also knows the weight so I don't really have to do anything like a scale read or any of that. I could rate shop it or it could have been preset to a carrier and I just could have said ship. Uh, in this case, we're just going to go ahead and grab FedEx and ship it. There are templates for this document for UPS, FedEx, and USPS. Uh, the orientation and the paperwork that you might use depends on the template. So uh, in this example, then the packing slip and shipping label that would get automatically printed. Uh, you can see here also in the viewer. So you see it's got a packing slip on the left, which has all the information you would expect in a packing slip with the details of what's in it. Uh, in a summary form and it's difficult because of the real estate that you're dealing with here we can look at it kind of on a full page view here with a PDF viewer but you can see here it's designed to put on the left hand side the detail of what's in the box the right hand side the actual label itself so you can decide how you want to use this some people might want to fold it in half and put it in a sleeve so that the label is visible on the outside of the package but not the contents uh, it's really up to you and how you want to implement this in your operation uh, that's it the quick look at the combined packing slip and shipping label.